Hey guys, welcome back to Beard Canics Garage. Today we are at the workshop with Rob and we'll be installing a K bar. Normally they get screwed on and stuff like that, but you know that if Rob is here, we are going to go with something a bit more permanent. <laughs> so, anyway, let's jump in the car, show you where it goes, what's the plan to actually make it fit right because it's not perfect. No. But yeah, anyway, let's crack on. <laughs> All right, so we're in the back. Yep. We've already stripped it, and basically, yeah, okay, bar. So goes there. The slight issue we've got is wherever it is. I it's think basically, it's, we think it's designed. Yeah, we think it's designed to take um, for when it's still got carpet or interior trim in it. So we're gonna close that gap up with some special packing metal and um, get it welded in. Uh, I've made some lovely spacers. They're actually quite thick, they're actually thicker than they are on the cable. So at least it'll be nice and strong. Let's see if they're too big. Like it was meant to be, and here it will actually hold in place, so you can weld it on stuff rather than like. Yeah. Still have a little bit of a play here, the well, that's something that the weld will cover perfectly. Ah oh, yeah, only if anything can probably squeeze it. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, it's just cleaning up. Cleaning the paint off. Good clean, make for a good weld. 1.05 Yeah, where's... Oh, it's pretty stable, it ju it's here and there it jumped quickly to 113, but really by not much But if it's the same on that... 105 Yeah, that's level then And it jumped here and there to 113, so it's exactly the same behaviour as on the K-bar, so... Bang on! If I draw around these, I know where I've got to clean the paint off Scotch pad, so that they remove they remove the paint and not too much metal. All right, oh, the man. welder is on. I'm gonna move this so I can see what I'm doing. Sounds like a good idea. We're all done. Let me switch around so you can see better. That's not coming out. <laughs> no. Let's 
still smoking here. Nice. I mean, you'll probably feel that. Yeah. Well, it's supposed, it's supposedly clear, but you feel quite nicely, so. You should feel, yeah. It'll be good. And to be fair, you know, I've done a lot to this car, but I've never actually Still done nice anything about, like, actually how it handles and anything like that quite yet, like, you know. So that's kind of like the first mode already yeah. for it. There is a kit I want that cover, like, all of the bottom, but, you know, yeah. for Christmas, maybe. Here we go, cleaned up and painted. Very quick clean up. Yeah. If you've been following the channel, you know eventually we are going to build a full cage in there, so there's plenty of lot going on. And like the body, we're going to like chop it so much, it's going to be nice and polished and looking good when it's all finished. And then probably get all manky the first time I sent it. <laughs> and here we go, guys. All done for this one. So as usual, Rob is Gozo Custom. Check out the link in the description. You can see a bunch of his work. And he's been working on some cool stuff, actually. Uh, and uh, yeah, if you haven't subscribed yet, yeah. subscribe, I guess. Give us a like if you enjoyed it. If you haven't enjoyed it, just go watch something else. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, yeah, see you in the next one. All right. See you later, guys. See ya.